Welcome to I Am Your Target Demographic. Today we are talking about the FBI in their most wanted list, which is a list of 10 people that the public should be looking out for right now. So we're gonna talk about what is this list? How do you make that list? And then who are the 10 people on the list right now? For those of you not in the United States, the FBI is the Federal Bureau of Investigation. In their words, the FBI is an intelligence-driven and threat-focused national security organization with both intelligence and law enforcement responsibilities. They offer up this top 10 list of wanted criminals that we're about to dive into. Here's some disclaimers before we begin. The definitive place to find all of this information in text format is the FBI.gov website, which will always have current top 10 most wanted lists. I'm making this video in August 2022, so in the future, the people on this list will likely change. I'm only using the photos provided by the FBI on their website to help you, as a person out in the world to look for these people. I have not altered these photos whatsoever. If you do see someone you believe is on this list, here's some options to contact them. You can use WhatsApp via 1-817-213-6640, or you can call 1-800-CALL-FBI, or you can submit online at tips.fbi.gov. Some history before we outline the 10 current names on the list. Since its creation in 1950, there have been 528 names on this top 10 list, with 492 of them being located or captured. The purpose of this list is to help the public get involved in finding these people, so it's meant to spread word, show their pictures, and hopefully equip random people to notice these criminals on the streets. What qualifies someone to be added to this list? These people are likely a danger to society and likely wouldn't be recognizable due to other media. A normal person would not know these faces. So this is a route to make people educated about some of the lesser known faces. Also disclaimer, these folks aren't necessarily guilty. They haven't been tried or arrested. They are simply wanted for these crimes. Now, in the order that they're listed on the website right now, let's go through the top 10. Jose Villarreal Hernandez, also known as El Gato is wanted for his alleged involvement in the interstate stalking and conspiracy to commit murder for hire of a 43-year-old male victim in 2013 in South Lake, Texas. A federal arrest warrant for these charges was issued in 2018. He allegedly holds an active leadership position in the Beltran Levia drug trafficking organization within the region of San Pedro Garzo Garcia, Nuevo Leon, Mexico. Yulong Carrillas, is charged federally in the Southern District of New York with racketeering conspiracy, cocaine importation conspiracy, and possession and conspiracy to possess machine guns. As the alleged leader of MS-13 for all of Honduras, he allegedly controlled criminal activity in Honduras and provided firearms, narcotics, and cash to MS-13. He is also allegedly responsible for supporting multi-ton loads of cocaine through Honduras to the United States and for ordering and participating in murders of rival gang members and others associated with MS-13. Badresh Kumar Patel is wanted for allegedly killing his wife by striking her multiple times with an object while they were both working at a donut shop in Hanover, Maryland in 2015. A local arrest warrant was issued a few days later and Patel was charged with first-degree murder, second-degree murder, first-degree assault, second-degree assault, and dangerous weapon with intent to injure. Omar Cardenas is wanted for his alleged involvement in the murder of a man that occurred on August 15, 2019 in a large outdoor shopping center in Silmar, California, immediately next to Los Angeles. It is alleged that he fired several rounds from a semi-automatic handgun at the victim, striking him in the head and causing his death. Alejandro Castillo is wanted for his alleged involvement in the murder of a co-worker in Charlotte, North Carolina in 2016. The female victim's vehicle was located at a bus station in Phoenix, Arizona on August 15, 2016. On August 17, the victim's body was located in a wooded area in Cabarrus County, North Carolina, with a gunshot wound to the head. Ruja Ignatova is wanted for her alleged participation in a large-scale fraud scheme. 
Beginning in approximately 2014, Ignatova and others are alleged to have defrauded billions of dollars from investors all over the world. She was the founder of OneCoin Limited, a Bulgaria-based company that marketed a purported cryptocurrency. In order to execute the schemes, she allegedly made false statements and representations to individuals in order to solicit investments in OneCoin. She allegedly instructed victims to transmit investment funds to OneCoin accounts in order to purchase packages, causing victims to send wire transfers representing these investments. Throughout the scheme, OneCoin is believed to have defrauded victims out of more than $4 billion. Ignatova is believed to travel with armed guards and or associates, and she may have had plastic surgery or otherwise altered her appearance. Jason Brown is wanted for murder and armed robbery in Phoenix, Arizona. During November of 2004, Brown allegedly shot and killed an armored car guard outside of a movie theater and then fled with the money. Brown speaks fluent French and has a master's degree in international business. He's an avid golfer, snowboarder, skier, and dirt biker. Brown enjoys being the center of attention and has been known to frequent nightclubs where he enjoys showing off his high-priced vehicles, boats, and other toys. Brown was a member of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints and completed his mission near Paris, France. Arnoldo Jimenez is wanted for allegedly killing his wife on May 12, 2012, the day after their wedding. He allegedly stabbed his wife to death in his black four-door 2006 Maserati, then allegedly dragged her body into the bathroom tub of her apartment in Burbank, Illinois. Jimenez was charged with first-degree murder by the Circuit Court of Cook County, Illinois, and a state warrant was issued for his arrest on May 15, 2012. Alexis Flores is wanted for his alleged involvement in the kidnapping and murder of a five-year-old girl in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. The girl was reported missing in late July of 2000, and was later found strangled to death in a nearby apartment in early August of 2000. Our last name on the list has actually been captured but not yet tried for his crimes, but we've got Rafael Caro Quintero who is wanted for his alleged involvement in the kidnapping and murder of a Drug Enforcement Administration special agent in 1985 in Mexico. Additionally, he allegedly held an active key leadership position directing the activities of the Sinaloa cartel. So hopefully you found this interesting, and remember to keep your eyes peeled, look for those 10 people, and keep checking back at the FBI website to see new names as they show up so that you can be totally educated. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.